Adam, we're back where it all began. Where it all began. The woods, the famous shoreline woods where every comic goes to cry. No, 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 I'm at your high school. Oh, my high school, yeah. Welcome sure. home. Thank you so much. Uh, back at Shorecrest High School, where I uh, knew that I wanted to make the jump to LA to, uh, you know, take a stab at the entertainment business, which uh, has worked out okay. Who believes in Sasquatch? <laughs> oh. Did you hear yourself? Obviously, Seattle's looking a little different these days. It's been suffering like much of the country. The cool part is you came back home and you brought a lot of your celebrity friends with you to fill the food bank. Yeah, it's it's uh, odd to see so many people struggling in a city that is, you know, always so vibrant. Mm. And, um, and uh, sorry, that was a text from The Rock. Um, just, that are you, Johnson right are now? you doing the interview with Chris Cashman? Don't act like you know who he is. This Friday, February 5th, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, got a bunch of my friends together to do a big show for Northwest Harvest. All the proceeds go to Northwest Harvest. You can come laugh for a good cause from the comfort of your own home and uh, help feed some families who are uh, in need uh, during these tough times. The lineup looks like it's the Emmy Awards. Yeah, Adam Devine, Eliza Schlesinger, Ron Funches, Thomas Lennon, Joey McIntyre from the New Kids on the Block, and it's Melissa McCarthy, Joel McHale, Seattleite, Sue Bird. What's more fun, <laughs> winning your fourth title or leaving the bubble and knowing you can go to the Cheesecake Factory? Oh, ooh, I do love a, you know, 90 page menu. Um, <laughs> we're gonna go with winning a championship. Hopefully this is one of many. Uh, I'd love to keep doing things like this to give back to the city. Tickets are available at rushticks.com. The show's called Adam Ray and Friends. 15 bucks and it's all for Northwest Harvest. Comedy, games, stand up, music. What else are you gonna do on a Friday? This will be the best virtual show during a pandemic on the first Friday in February that you'll ever see. What a great idea.